Hello, everybody. Welcome back to more Guild of Dungeoneering. We've got ourselves the uh, Pirate DLC section, I believe, to go through here. It's been quite brutal. I assume that the Tier 3 stuff is indeed supposed to be after it. Uh, I, I, I would assume. We've got a couple uh, a couple new characters, if I remember correctly. Yeah, we have the, the Super Chump just became the Ultra Chump a little bit ago. There's the Shapeshifter, Spence, and then we've got Rhapsody, our Mathemagician, who is a Tier 3. So I feel like let's save him for a moment because I feel like he's going to blow everything out of the water. <laughs> I, that's my guess. That From everything I've been uh, told and everything I've heard, the Tier 2s and 3s, like, it, it becomes almost required that you use those classes. So we'll see. We shall see. I'm not going to say we're not going to send anybody out on suicide missions in the hopes that they get some kind of a glory, though. Like, absolutely. That's very much my jam. Uh, but for now, let's check out the shapeshifter in the Ruffled Feathers mission. Let's go for that. Fingers crossed. I don't... I'm not guaranteeing this uh, is a good class, but hey, squawk. <laughs> okay. Defeat the Flaming Gala. The level three that I assume is going to chase me. It's got burn. Interesting. Not always inherently bad. And ferocious. So let's take a moment to uh, acquaint ourselves with this. Okay, so we start with growth. Start with growth. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's the whole passive. Regenerate two health. I mean, that's good. Aspect of the Panther is a good move as well. You know, to have, sure. One damage quick, two physical damage. Aspect of the dragon, one magic damage, two block. Barkskin, three red block. And then we have rekindle. Uh, I mean, like, sure? It doesn't sound bad, but also... I'm, uh, I'm a little surprised that this... Like, th these are nice cards, but... I'm surprised that this is a, an entire level two. Oarsman. Eve ho. Let's fight Eve -ho. the oarsmen here. I should I should try being an oarsman. I mean, is it a class? Yeah, I mean bark skin is good to start with, but it, it's the same thing you get for um what is it? Uh armor one, so Yowza. Let's think here. So I don't want to do the oh god we did it we did enough damage for it to be a problem anyways. Eh, it doesn't matter. We we win, we win. Inherently put back. Inherently we just have a little bit more health. So it shouldn't be that big of a deal. I would like to go for um growth. I mean that sounds nice. I, I guess I'll get blade two for now, but yeah, I would like to go for growth. Squire! It's interesting. Yeah, we're being chased by a level three. Oh, I've never fought one of Blow these. The they <laughs> Blow, Blow the man, the man down. down. Blow the man down. I've never fought one of these, so I have some concerns. Okay, we'll hit him with the decay turn one here while we can. Spiky obviously being a concern. Uh, okay, sure. We should be fine. You gain conceal. It's not going to help you right now, my friends. Okay, so far so fine with the uh, the shapeshifter. Growth two. There we go. Let's do it. Growth two. Right. Growth three now. There's only one. I think there's there's a growth four, isn't there? There's a cranky parrot. Let's explore. Get a little bit of gold here. Maybe we can fight another level two. Worst comes to worst, I will fight that son of a gun, but... I would like to, bare minimum, get, like, another rune or something here. Sure. Freebie. Pummel. Uh. I would have liked to, uh, you know, get the other vibe, uh, the, the triple block, but hey, we'll take it, we'll take it, we'll take it. Bark skin. 
I'm gonna try and keep myself, uh, keep my little block move here. I think that'll be good. Trash, that's a three damage and one damage to them. So we are perfectly fine to drop that bad boy on their face. Big disgrace. Why do you even have spiky? Do you have any blocks? There it is. Oh, I forgot about rum. Well, it shouldn't proc again for what it's worth. Please don't have a three damage. Okay. Huh. That got kind of gross. That got kind of gross. I'm confused about the shape shapeshifter being a, a higher tier. Take it. I mean, they're obviously not bad. All right, let's, let's fight you here and like let's get ready to uh, to fight the flaming parrot. Dude, come on. It's a waste of a turn, all in all. Because he's not doing anything either, so heal and steal an opponent's card. See, here's the thing. If he, oh, if he gets, uh, oh, I hate it. If he gets the respite card, I could use it to my advantage. Like it could actually not be a problem at all. No, uh, I hate it. I hate it. I hate what I've done. Good news is this is a freebie. They don't get anything from respite. I'm a little afraid of drawing a magic attack. We don't have very many. I said we don't have very many. I said we don't have very many. Come on. Okay, well, rekindle at least heals us. But they get healed too because of respite. They truly, truly lucked out with that draw there. Yeah, we shouldn't have let them get it, but I think we're gonna be all right. As long as we keep on making sure we do one damage. This sucker is very dead. Yeah, we win. All right. That was the thing. So I thought we could get around it. I thought we had so many damage attacks that it wouldn't be a problem. It was only kind of right. Is this better for the fight we're going against right now? I don't know. I would love to take this if we were the Ultra Trump. Roll the man down. Let's just do it. Don't want to put any other gold in the way because then we won't get there. <laughs> this could be bad. Fine. Perfect. Okay. Uh, we kind of want to do... Uh, do we just get rid of Rum? Now let's do this. Hope we draw one damage move. Perfect. Highly perfect. Because now we can uh, we can kill through through Rum. Nice, 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 nice. All right, open for a shirt. Fate cursed. Eh, fine. I'll take those upgrades uh, over the fact of doing, I guess, just one favor? We only have one favor anyway, yeah. I thought we had two. This could go wrong. Actually, there's no way this... <laughs> we have burn. Unblockable. You pull out a three damage move, I cry. Okay. I'm okay with you taking regenerate, kinda. 
So I feel like I'll get a two damage move. And then that is... Oh. Alright, well, we should win anyways. Decay should have... I thought Decay was going to proc. Are you kidding me? This is how this goes? This is how you do this to me? Oh, come on! Wow. Quite an amusing display of courage and heroics. But alas, we must forgo hooray. Wow. You've flown it. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I'm failing to see how that's on par with the um the barbarian, and I'm failing to see how it's on par with even the super chump, let alone the ultra chump. Maybe I'm again, maybe it's a snow witch situation, maybe I'm missing something. But all it gets is some moves that it starts with that are a little better than normal. Not even like not even that much better than normal. Like I'm trying to process here. Like, uh, Ice Cream Monk has a better level one, you know? Ah. Ice Cream Monk has a better level one than that. Uh, and they're technically a level one class. So, I don't know. Do we bring in the Ultra Chump? Bring in the Ultra Chump. The hell? I don't want to risk it because we have to go to it. Uh, let's save that for the inevitable two damage move that you have. God, our us! They're three damage blasts! That's so broken! How is it even on par? I mean, this is t technically, I think this is a tier three class, right? Um. Ignite is useless for the boss fight. Like, actively useless. Flame Lash is nice, and another uh is fine, but we, we could just get something else. Our starting cards are just better. Hot Squawk. There's a world where we can take down the Skeleton Pirate right now. Like, for, for real. I don't think that's even out of my mind. Three, six, nine, ten, eleven. They, because he has brittle, and we have two two moves that do three damage, so they would do five. Not right now. I think we can though. I think we can. Uh, um, fine. We'll go back one space. I think that's okay. Ah. He's gonna go there, but we still have we still have distance, you know. We win these. It's going to be actually kind of sloppy. Unless we get the... Okay, yeah, I was going to say, unless we get the speedy attack. I would rather have Spyglass than this right now. Because, again, uh, Flaming Poncho is... Giving us Ignite is actually... It's a detriment. It's a bad card for us to have. Actively. Oh! Well, why did we want to fight the level one? That's never... I hate... I hate the system sometimes. I really do. Why did we want to go out of our way for the to fight the level one? 
I thought that they were supposed to prioritize new areas. Uh, whatever. All right. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Let's get something good. I mean, here's the thing about this class. It's kind of so cracked that we might be fine. Yeah, I think we might be fine. It's genuinely that busted. Yeah, I think we win. Yeah, we, we just won. What the hell, man? That's just, it's not even hard. <laughs> it was like, that was a brainless one. Ultra Chub, wow. Would, you'd be so very brave. Now we need somebody else to fill this empty grave. Man, I yeah, I don't know how I feel about how um how much the tier of the units matters. Uh we got uh Lupus. It's like, it is really, really important. Like, I, I'm of the mind that I wish you could train the level 1 units. Hell, I wish you could just multi-class the units so that you could turn the cat, like, the person you have as cat burglar, you could upgrade them into one of the other classes or something. I don't know. Just uh, something on that mind, it feels like, I don't like the idea that we are probably, like, supposed to kind of forget about them and sort of neglect them from here on out. I don't like that. That That is kind of a bummer because I've grown attached to some of them, and I just don't know if we're supposed to be using them or not. All right, I'll tell you what. Lupus, we're giving the shapeshifter another crack here. L impress me, shapeshifter. Thanks ye for catching all them pears, chum. Make a fine feast for the crew. What the hell? Oh, it's a new class. Cleaver Joe attacks in 10 turns. Good or bad? Good. Heroism? We take those. I actually think this class could lose uh, against the oarsman. I don't think it's likely. Oh. Um. Let's use a little bit of a little bit of stall tactics. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, so we have, and then we have Aspect of the Panther. As long as you don't have a uh, magic damage block, we're good. <laughs> Fundamentally terrifying. I mean, if we didn't have this, that would be scary. But yeah, I would like to probably go, well, I was going to say go, go for the holy path. But I don't know if that makes a lot of sense. Unless we get that one specific... Here, yeah, we want to connect this because we want to pick up the upgrade there for the rune, the favor. Cool. Yeah, the monkey ain't too, ain't too scary. He can be, but he's got no traits. Okay. We'll take a dub. We'll take a dub. Fire, uh, girth one, arcane one. Sure, sure. I'm hoping to get like a little bit better uh, upgraded items, but hey, pirate guffaw. I'm not telling ye. I don't want to jump up to a level three. If we were the ultra chump, I think we could make a jump to a level three. But since we're the class we are, okay. Uh, what would I be most upset for you to pull? I would be happy if you pulled Mind Strike. I'd be really happy. Because we don't care about them drawing cards. Draw An enemy drawing a card doesn't... It actually doesn't mean anything. Like, literally. Okay. Definitely just don't attack into that. And then... Just hope we draw, like, any attack? Anything? Okay. Or not. Doesn't even matter. Bye-bye. 
bark vest. Tenacious rejuvenate. We do get one stupidity, but I think it's worth it. I think it's worth it. All right, that's a that's a pretty big get. Pretty big get. Cabin boy. Hi, me. Seven turns. Oh, and he's mundane. Oh, no. <laughs> Cabin boy. I'm fine with discarding some stuff. We get a card draw and we, uh, and we get to do two damage. So, seems good to me. Seems good, man. All right. And now you just die. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Cabin boy. Do I want all that? Because that just makes it harder for me to grab my tier 4 growth spell. So, I think I don't want it. You'll never find it. Rum. Crewmate. See, here's the thing. I don't think that you're that scary. Armed 3, Rage 2, Pickpocket 1. Are you a crewmate? You're not crewmate. Okay. I think that we can handle this, and then we're uh, we're level four in case the zeiss the strikes. Okay, this is a freebie. Try and avoid him being at love or level one at HP one. See, here's the thing. I don't think that respite's good for us. Mm. Okay, I spoke too soon. We immediately got okay. I spoke too soon again. Respite's cracked. Kind of want to do a one damage move into a two damage move. That's like, that's the hope here. Hey, hey. Yeah, you steal my uh. Let's go. And then on top of that, we just, we overheal. We're healthier than when we started, you nerd. Flintlock, nah. Arcane three. Is no joke. Ah. If it was stupidity one arcane plus three, yes, I would take it. I, I'm not going to take it like that because I don't want to replace my other stuff right now. Buccaneer, Fury. I think we'll probably just avoid her. <laughs> Is there treasure? There's treasure under there. And what's your deal? Respite. Rum, respite, and fury. Ooh, that's actually terrifying. That's kind of scary. We do not like fighting respite with our build. Yeah, well, it's fine. It's not that bad. Think about this, think about it, think about it, think about it. Uh -huh. Arr. Okay, well, we're not going for that one. Oh, okay. Do you move towards us? Yep. I don't know. I'm trying to think if I even want to fight another level three. Or if I just want him to jump on us. Fantastic. More draws is... It's a good call when they have spiky. Because you don't want to... You want to have the perfect option to not feed him here. Yeah, we want to go for a one damage into this because he has rum. Head blow. Head blow is an unblockable, right? It doesn't have. 
Oh, no. I'm just wrong. Bye! Hmm. It might be good. Cleaver Joe strikes me as, well, but we don't really want defensive stuff. Yeah, we don't really, I don't think we want to do that. Three turns, so two turns. Do you have, do you have Hunter? Eh, it messes things up a bit. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know if I want to fight the Buccaneer. It might not be a good idea. Where's our music? Oh. Gosh, Rejuvenate is so good. If we could get the... The offhand that lets us heal up. Oh. Well. Kind of net neutral. We both do one damage. If we get the... Yeah, the... The offhand that lets us heal an extra time. Or plus... Heal for plus one whenever we heal. I think we stall this. We go for... Hope for... A, uh, okay. Actually, it's fine. Actually, this is... No, this is ideal. Because then rum doesn't proc... Just don't have a block move. Oh, you jerk. I actually think we stop this here because I don't want to have to deal with that. And we go for this. Otherwise, we have to play around rum, and I don't think that that... If anything was going to get us hurt there or die, that could have been it. Okay. I think we do that. Yeah, I think we do that. I... Because I, I, I said that... I, I specifically said if we had an Arcane 3 stupidity. And I... I was saying that, and I forgot that it was a real thing, so. Two turns. Where can we get to? In two turns. It's good or bad, good or bad, good or bad. Found a power, which is... I don't think I have any unblockables. Do I? That's irrelevant to me. We'll, uh, we'll see what happens. Uh -huh. Yeah. We just give ourselves a treasure so we avoid the fight. just unblockables, right? Right, yeah. And we do we do have one. Okay, fine. Since we have literally any, I'll I'll do it. I'll do it. Holy moly. That is ridiculous. I'm hoping that that is the scariest move you have, because what the hell uh, was that? Drop this, please. God dang it. Okay, so what's half for you? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So, three, four, five, six. So we want to do two damage. So we don't. That means we don't want to do the other. I, you know, it's just it's obscene. Like I, I'm so glad we have this move because otherwise, screw you. Do you have a quick move, please? Quick move, please? Quick move, please? <sighs> Absurd! Alright. Nope. 
I think we could really die. I really, like, genuinely think we could die here. No doubt in my mind. This is... This thing's bonkers, this situation. Alright, you have respite, so we need to do damage. So this is a way to heal while still doing damage. This is... This is a little annoying. Uh... Yeah, no, that's, uh, it's annoying, it's annoying, it's annoying. But what else was I gonna do? Mind Strike, I need to keep him from healing an extra one with Respite. Man. Just, I hate when they give bosses Respite. I'm just going to do this so we can hopefully draw it again. That is going to put him under half for Fury, though. Which is problematic. <laughs> it's very problematic. Oh, mama. We, we're, that's still a, a swing loss of two, which is really annoying. Okay, I'm happy you have Flare to not get a benefit from Fury, but you've got to be kidding me here. I think we... Wait, we win this? We win this? Wait, oh, we win this on this turn. I was going to say, do we win this on next turn because of our quick attack? Got about the minus one from trash. That was very close. Way too close. Here's to you, young oh. dungeoneer. You stood your ground and acted very brave. <laughs> but how long before you feel the fear? And how long before you're in your grave? <laughs> Got a new special class, I think. Poop deck. Drunken sailor! With the yo ho ho and a bottle of rum, they stand there shouting and swaying. No one knows whether it's clever or dumb what the drunken sailor is saying. Excuse me. <laughs> Alright, we've got. Let's see here. Wad 8 to 8. Welcome aboard. <laughs> Drunken Sailor. Is it a tier two? It's a tier two. Clumsy left jab. What the heck? Oh, oh, they get rum. Okay. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's it's a uh unreliable well. If you get what's that thing? Um, what's it called? Re whatever the resilient one is, where you can't die unless you're on one health at the start of your turn. That we we can get that to force rum, which is actually pretty good. See, th this class does seem yeah it seems worthy of the level two. I would say high priority. Pick up high priority is probably burning this. I think that would make sense. Reckless Swing is fine. Kind of wild. Fall over. Funny. I mean, Squinty Eye. Y you know, sure. You know, sure. But let's, um, let's explore. We just unlocked a bunch of stuff. Big Booty. The Broken Boat. And the Sand Fortress. All right, uh, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and do the shapeshifter again. Let, let's give it a little bit of a little bit of play. We'll bring in some uh, some of the other classes later as they are more appropriate. This is still a ship, isn't it? Wait, we got like a Theseus vibe going on. Okay, we're supposed to get that. Collect a large chest. Uh, is this a large chest in your mind? Deckhand? Uh, 
Venom 3 is a no-go for me. Venom 3 is a no-go for me. I think that that kills this set, uh, this Dungeoneer. Okay, I'm glad we have Health Nut. Helps us out here. But... Okay, so we actually kind of have to do this. We don't have to, but I think this is the play. And then we go for the fast attack with the hope that... Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think that you'll have a magic block. You don't look... You don't strike me as the kind of guy who would. Um... Yeah. Ain't broke. Don't fix. That being said, we kind of need to go for big swings because we... Well, we don't have to fight the Skeleton Pyro. We could, like... We could go around, is the funny thing there. Alright. Fingers crossed, man. Don't be too bad. Don't be too bad. You'll love to see it. Oh, when you have the perfect counter card, it just feels, it feels incredible. Not, there's nothing quite like it on this planet. Aspect of the bolt for the win. Okay, yeah, the eel's not too bad. Oof. Let me let me look at the skeleton again here. Plus one health if another crewmate is defeated. Mermaid is mundane. We can actually do pretty well with that, I think. Try and rush down. Wow. The fact that we actually come out ahead on that is bonkers. Whoa. Mermaid's cracked. Good. I don't know what you got. I'm just going to close my eyes for a second. <laughs> uh -oh. Don't want to connect it yet. We could maybe get in and sneaky, sneaky steal it. Good draw, really good draw. Really fine, irrelevant. <laughs> really fine draw, it's just the default. A. Incoming gnarly moves though, right? No, not too bad. Can we kill here? Yeah, we kill here. We kill here. And we kill full health too. Shocking. I don't want to. I don't want to level move one move like that right now. I'm trying to figure out how we can do this without fighting that guy, because he seems terrifying. Keep on going. Does he just move one space back and forth? He moves towards us. Is 
Gambit. Okay. This is a Gambit. Alright, now we need to be lured this way. That guy don't move. Oh! He's a genius! Wait! Oh my god. He's an idiot. He's an idiot! That's not it! We have to go the X marks the spot. Oh my god. Screw you! Oh, we're dead, man. That, that, oh, that, that hurts. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Well, we're still, we're, we're, I don't know. We're probably, we're probably boinked, but sure. We kind of, kind of rectified our problem a little. Heal up. We've got all these. We can sabotage. We can draw. We can block. I don't know. I don't know what we want to do yet. Fine with doing a one for one trade. It's not great. Something scarier is going to be showing up, I'm sure. Yeah, like that. Oh, wait. Okay. Sure, we're ahead now, but. Uh, okay. Woo, baby. Okay. We're good. We're good. We win. Yikes. Yikes. That one tripped me up. That one tripped me up. Hurrah, hurrah, victory. Eh. That was so quick you made it look easy. Another happy tale in our short story, if not a little bit violent, and not for the queasy. Look at our dang trophy room. It's kind of nice. Oops. Nope. Let's go get, uh, what a load of crab. You stumbled into the crab lair. It's, I don't know. It's a shapeshifter day. We're, we're gonna, we're gonna learn. You've found the crab room. Defeat three giant crabs. All blocks are increased by one. Uh, Crush might actually be pretty good then. Because we want to get some unblockables. I don't know what kind of block he has. If he doesn't block magic, then I guess I don't care <laughs> about the plus one block. You know what I'm saying? I'm so glad we have the other thing. Spit acid is gnarly. I almost went on reflex with the quick attack. That would have been bad. Could have di could have died. Like actually, cutlass. Oh. Oh boy. I, I love Blade. I love Tenacious. What can I say? It has nothing to do with the unblockable path, but hey. Elite Narwhal. Let's just stall for a sec. I, I don't want to fight a mermaid. I think a mermaid is worse. Like, an, an eel is genuinely pretty spooky on its own. I'll fight a crab with two favor and then we'll work it out from there. What we want to do right after that. This is fine. I'll take an HP upgrade there. Sure. 
a one one to one trays until the end of this is a is a victory for us. So sure. I don't care. Yeah. Thank you, HP. How much magic damage does a crab do? How much magic damage does a crab do? Watch it do a lot. Armed five. Aquatic, I don't know what that is. Like one or the other. Fingers crossed, this could go wrong. Oh. Aw, oh, beans. Aw, oh, beans. Cool. All right. All right. I'm thinking of using my favor, but uh, wow, I did not realize you had so much magic damage, you little jerk. So much. Okay, that could that could be the big swing we need. If we can just do it. Yowza. Does Decay stay? Still? Nope. Decay is now gone. Uh huh. This is gone pooish. Mundane. Okay. Well, we actually can't die this turn because of our, our, our special, special thing. I know we had the other move, but I just wanted to style. Skin of your teeth. What's that? Kill a monster the same turn. Tenacious saves your life. <laughs> uh, well, that was really close. <laughs> I did not like it. I do like the idea of this. An unblockable and spiky. Is very nice. All right. We can just go kill some crabs. Free money. Money. There we are. Hmm. Right off the bat, a little bit of a, a little bit of an ouch, a little bit of a feels bad. We do have our draw. We have our block. If we need to go for it. Again, though, one to one trades are fine for us. We like them. Good, 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 good. Bad, 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 bad. It was something. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You little piece of trash. Decay might actually save us here. Can we just? I'll draw if I need to, but screw you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh. That was a little gross. Maybe switch it up here. Can't spend our fate then. Don't have a chance to change your fate. Crush three is nice. I don't want to lose the ability to spend favor. Fleet footed would be incredible. I don't want to lose tenacious though, because I think it I think it might actually come to it. Alright. Let's use our favor. Just gonna do it right now. 
Make sure we're making sure we're doing everything uh, as optimally as I well as personally theoretically optimally as we can. All right, bad situation. Just a bad situation. These draws are not working for us here. They are not in our favor. I, 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 I can't, man. Those, everything there, that was like as perfectly bad as it could have gone for draws up to that point. Perfectly terrible. I'm going to keep the double magic block because the magic moves are more likely to ruin me. Perfect. There we go. That's why I, I, I could tell that crush was the way to go. Wait, spiky. Forgot we got that. Bop, 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 bop. That was weirdly close. A dungeoneering marvel. Oh. You really are improving. But please do try to be ever so careful. Winning is so close to losing. Ain't it <laughs> the truth? But alas, that is going to be where we call it here for today. Some relatively successful stuff. Poor Spence. Uh, at least killed five monsters. Died on the boss. You know, it's a very, it's an honorable way to go. Uh, and then let's see here. Right after that, how many, how many successful runs did you just go on here? Three, three successful runs. I mean, you know, we take those. We take those. I'm, I'm very excited to go for this. Oh my god, I'm not. I'm not going to look anymore. But it seems very promising. Alas, alas, that is that. That is going to do it for today. If you like the series and you would be sad to see it go, you got to let me know. So comment down below. Like if you enjoy the video, and if you want your name on a Dungeoneer that may or may not die on their very first outing, <laughs> I can't make any promises, then you can support over on Patreon. Anybody at the $5 tier or higher gets their name on a Dungeoneer gets to be immortalized as part of the series here. But if you cannot financially afford it in any way, if it'll cause any kind of a problem, don't do it. I'll be mad at you if you do it at that point. But if you can, consider it. Thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you for checking the channel for Roguelikes and more every single day, and I'll see you next time. Bye.